over here at the boat works. We've got the uh, Penobscot 14 tiller glued up, a little piece of cypress for the tiller. And we put in this uh, teak end. Hopefully uh, take care of some uh, splitting issues we had. We are working on the uh, rudder also. Wanted to had a fix wanted a fixed blade versus a swing blade so we're cut this uh, rudder shape out out of uh, marine grade Douglas fir plywood can seal it up with some total boat wood sealer we've got one side going see if we can get it flipped over to the other side a little trick I saw I think Louie uh, showed it to us on some of his total boat videos is just throw a few uh, screws down on the table and when you lay the piece back over it it's, it's held up off the table you'll have one little spot where the screw heads are but you can just take your wood sealer and I like to just dip it and I like to go cross grain first. And then as it dries, I'll come and brush back into this wet edge. This is the first coat, and I plan on putting a lot of lot on here, but I'll make sure to go back and look for drips. But being the first coat, if I have to go and do a little sanding along an edge to take care of it, then we will. The difference with the uh, marine grade plywood versus your, just your basic plywood, the marine grades usually will have more layers. It will have fewer voids, in other words, fewer repairs. Sometimes you'll see something that looks like a football cut out of it. If you get an A grade, that means you should get a side with basically no voids that have been repaired and maybe a B graded side on the other that might have one or two. But it'll have more plies and it'll be glued together with waterproof. waterproof glue. So, uh-oh, fumes may be getting to me. And then, oops. Got a little brush bristle there. I'm still wet enough. I'll just take it out. Just buy these little, little chip brushes is what I like to use. I try to run my fingers and pull any loose bristles out, but every now and then you get one that pops out. Some people like the foam brushes. I've always been happy with these. These are two inch. Ordered them from Jamestown Distributors. And that's where the wood sealer came from also, their total boat product. So get that sealed up, that means the future coats of varnish will be, this will seal the pores, build a little base for the varnish to go on next. So that's what we're working on at the Boatworks tonight. Hope y'all have a great evening.